see what's good. Yo, shut up. <laughs> little spooky tree screaming in the background. <laughs> Team Skull, get back that Pokemon. Oh! <laughs> Don't give me trouble. I'll reduce you to rubble. Oh! That's right, we're gonna sell this Pokemon to get rich, and we won't make no bones about it. If you want it back, you're gonna have to take it. Oh! <laughs> Stand firm. Think of what the president would say. Yo, who is this? That's what you say, chief. But you don't lift a finger. <laughs> Why am I the Aether Foundation's last line of defense? What would become of the Foundation if something were to happen to me now? <laughs> uh, so. Ah, here's a promising young trainer. Fight in my stead, child, and root these team score ruffians. I bestow honor upon you if you do. Okay. I mean, I don't mind taking on some Team Skull dudeses. You ready? Cause I was born ready, yo. Let's see. Manny might not be the best Pokemon to take you guys on, but we're going for it anyways. Let's see what you got, bro. Yeah. Eradicate. Hmm. That might be a little too strong for me. I got a shiny Wingo, that Pokemon dude. <laughs> oh wait, we got Leech Life. Super effective. Ooh, nice dodge. Hey, that's damage. I'll take it. Although another one might not kill it. Oh yeah, I was afraid that was going to do a little too much. So it did like almost 40. We're not getting that much recovered. Dang it. Maybe it won't go for Hyper Fang. Maybe we'll get hella lucky. Oh! Dang it! Yo, I'm reviving Manny, I don't care. I'm getting that experience off this thing. Hmm. Alright, let's go out to Diggy. No, not Diggy. Let's go out to Salty Splatoon. Hey. Alright. Now I'm gonna heal up. Not gonna miss out on that experience, you know? Come at me, bro. Yeah, I didn't think I would take that well either. You know what? I don't wanna let Salty Splatoon die though either. It's about to level up. Whatever, though. This is for Manny. Unfort. I'm sorry, friend. Okay. Now Manny can come back in and take all of this experience. I forgot I was holding an Eviolite, too. Oh my gosh. That would have done so much damage then. That's ridiculous. Can you, like, miss one or something? Hey. I actually want to look up how this thing evolves. Because I am curious. Hey. Eradicate. Taken down. Let's see that experience. 639, okay. Not bad. Oh, Mantis. Oh, it gets contrary, too. Ooh, shiny is cool. Level 34 during the daytime. Dang. Yo, we can make that happen, though. We still got some rare candies, too. Yeah. That loss was pathetic. Your moves were so kinetic. We don't need this Pokemon anyway. Take it, then. Good luck and good riddance. We saved the Slowpoke. Yay! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> he didn't even know what was going on. Yes, indeed. You are a trial goer, aren't you? You're a splendid trainer. I'm deeply impressed. I'd like to reward you by showing you something truly astounding. Once you've finished your grand trial, come to the Hano Grand Resort, and I will take you to see a wondrous place. Okay. I'm so glad there are nice young trainers like you around. Good luck on your island challenge. Oh, well, thank you. Okay. Here we go. 
What's good? Oh. <gasps> Dang. It's about that time. So you're the one Gaudion, oh, Gladion was talking about. Hmm. You don't look like anything special to me. Oh, snap. I'm Plumeria. <laughs> Plumeria? I help keep Team Skull together. I'm like a big sister to all these numbskulls. You have realized what idiots all these guys are, right? But don't think some dummies are cute in their dumbness. What? <laughs> yeah, sure. You know what I mean, right? You picking on my cute, dumb brothers and sisters is really annoying me. Whoa! So we're just gonna battle just like that, huh? Alright. Let's give it a shot. Let's see what you got. With your plums and such. Show me your plums. A Golbat! Okay, well. That's clearly not ideal for Manny. I'm trying to use a grass Pokemon on my team. But it's weak to everything. Hmm. They do have Diggy. Alright. Let's try Diggy. Get him! Yeah, we're ready. Okay. You're supposed to go for a poison move. Yo, catch this rock tomb though. Oh, he's faster than me. That's not okay. All right, come on, Diggy. Get off this rock tomb, though. You got this! Yeah. There we go. Nice that Pokemon, dude. All right. And now let's finish him off. Hey, snapping out of confusion like a boss. That's what's up, Diggy. You're a real MVP. Ooh, nice experience. And Wingo leveled up too. And Woody. Woody wants to learn Screech? Nah. Woody's moveset is legit right now. So land it. Alright, fine, Diggy. You can have this one too. Show him what's good. Ah. Why is everything so fast? I mean, you're still dead, bro. Hey. I thought Doug Trio was supposed to be hecka speedy. I haven't cleaned Doug Trio yet since it evolved. Now you're just gonna have dirt right there every time. Hey. <laughs> Your hair is crazy. Which one do I feed it to? Oh no! <laughs> I have to... <laughs> I have to choose a different one to feed it to each time. They're gonna get jealous of each other. Favoritism and whatnot. <laughs> You're pretty strong, I'll give you that. But mess with anyone in Team Skull again and I'll show you how serious I can get. Dang. So this was just a test. Alright, well, I keep being attacked. They better heal my Pokemon before this. Because I keep getting stopped every time I'm trying to come through here. New Age! Oh, snap. Lily got lost again, so I brought her here to you. She couldn't even find her way to the Tide Song Hotel on her own. That's messed up. She said she saw Team Skull and tried to avoid them. That's why she got lost. Now I've got to go. The Master Royale has a match and there's no way that I'm missing that fight. Oh snap. The Master Royale. What do you think he looks like under that mask anyways? Oh my gosh. <laughs> What's up, Lily? I came here for Nippy. Though, as you saw, I didn't come here myself so much as I was brought here with me. Oh, brought here with the Professor's help. Oh, Look at your poor Fomantis. Let me heal it for you, won't you? Yes, please. I actually think Fomantis is fine, but Diggy's not looking so hot. Within these ruins waits the guardian deity of Akala Island. This is Tapu Lele's ruin. I don't have anything to get past those boulders. You know, 
I tried to drag me along to the ruins of conflict on Mele Mele Island too. Why are these ruins so important to you? Why do the Guardians mean to you? Oh. I don't know. <laughs> Just think what could have happened if you knew age hadn't been there back then. <laughs> you would have died from Spiro. Oh, snap. Oh, I haven't seen you with Koo... <laughs> With Kakui. <laughs> or oh, I haven't seen Kakui. I'm reading this all wrong. Oh, yes, my name is Lily. I work as a Professor Kakui's assistant. And this is New Age. I've already met her. Oh, I'm sorry. I ain't never asked your name before, did I? Tapu Lele summoned me here to clean up these ruins. New Age, thanks for getting to know the people in Pokemon of Alola. Okay, so what's happening now? I mean, we need to battle, right? Is it going down right now, right her? All right then. You've completed the trials of all three captains here on Akala Island. Now you face the grand trial of the Kahuna, me. Get ready for your hardest Pokemon battle yet on Akala. Let's do it. Great, we're gonna give you guys everything we've got. And my partners are all adorable, rugged little rock types. Let's get it ooh kahuna olivia starting with a nose spas okay pretty good for manny let's get it on level 26 okay a little beefy but i think we got this one Oh, she's definitely got that Evio light on him. Not cool. And Thunder Wave in me. Let's go for Leaf Blade again. Oh, you trying to flinch me, bro? Why'd that do so much? Oh, it was a crit. I was like, do I not have an Evio light or what? Well, if that's the case, then another one shouldn't knock me out, and I can heal next turn. As long as she doesn't flinch me. Huh? Damn it! I mean, either way, I'm healing this turn. I'd probably prefer that anyways, because then I'd have to heal completely against something else. Alright, let's go. Hey, Nice! Alright, Manny. Let's finish it up. Hit him with another leaf blade. Yeah. There you go. Alright, who's next? Got some nice experience, Manny. Boldor. Okay. I think I'm going to try and heal the status. And then, uh, and then heal my HP, because I should be able to take a hit, as far as I know. Yeah, trying to para-flinch me? Get out of here. So that's her strategy, huh? That's what she relies on. Alright, well, we're gonna heal up Manny, and then we're gonna keep it going. And now we're faster. That does, like, 20? Almost 25. That's crazy. Huh? Dang. Why she gotta have Evil Light on, like, all of her Pokemon? And now I have to attack this. Or I have to heal. Alright, come on, Manny. I'm gonna keep healing you. You got this. Gonna get that experience. Rock Blast? Why did that do so much? What the heck? Okay, and it's just not gonna stop. I'm reviving it. I don't care. I'll send out something that'll die. Alright, let's go, Wingo. If you don't die, then you could attack it, but... I'm trying to let Manny handle this one. Dang, clearly Eviolite means nothing. 
What's up, Colseer? Like, what are this thing's defenses? Oh my gosh! Its stats are horrible! For, like, HP and defense and stuff. I'm going for Water Pulse. How much is its evolution? Oh yeah, its HP is much better. Well, actually, with the Evo Light, uh, yeah, it's still better. There you go, Manny. Getting that level 26. Lycan Rock. Ooh. I want to let Manny do something, but you know what? I don't think it's going to happen. Let's go, Moana. Let's blow this thing back. You don't stand a chance, bro. This is the first time. Let's hit him with some power. Hydro Vortex, my dude. Please. Let him know what's good. Yeah. It's over, bro. Straight up over. Take him down, Moana. Yeah. It's a wrap. There you go, Moana. Good going. <laughs> what happened? I thought that was going to be hard. Manny, why did you die to all those moves? That was kind of sad. Not going to lie to you. Uh, just a tad bit on the sad side. But you know what? We're going to... We're gonna keep using you for now. See if we can get you to evolve and such. You know? See what happens then. Have some faith. See if maybe you get better. Alright. Diamonds only sparkle after coal is pushed to its absolute limit. Hey. You guys are the best. Here's the rock type Z crystal. The Rockium is all yours. Rocky on the Z. Hey, nice. Hey, another island down. What's my favorite Alola Pokemon? Like Gen Seven or the form? Um, I don't know as far as like favorite. In general, I like a lot of them. The rock type Z power you have, you have to move like this to draw it out. Oh, gotcha. 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 Let's see it. Oh! Hey! Gen 7? I don't know. Sogaleo is pretty legit. Dang, she wants to be a trainer. And so is uh, Pre-Marina and Two Cannon. They're awesome. As far as forms go, I don't know. I guess Executor would be my favorite. Or Ninetales. I really like Dugtrio. It's been fun to use, though. The Rock type. It's hard, sturdy, rugged, and physically strong. So nothing like me at all. I guess opposites really do attract. Oh, snap. What's up, Nippy? <laughs> you look very pleased, don't you? By the way, Lily, this might be a weird question, but why even come to the ruins of life if you're not a trainer? Oh, because of Nippy. It's not originally from here, and I wanted to help it get back to its home. But I don't have any idea how to do that. It seems fond of the ruins for some reason, so I keep visiting them and hoping that maybe I'll find some clue to help it. You certainly don't see a Pokemon like that every day. <laughs> Tapu Lele may be called the guardian deity of our island, but it can also run wild at times. Regular Pokemon normally avoid the guardians at all costs. 
Unless they're strong enough to face the Tapu themselves, that is. Oh! You got some inner strength up in there? Wait, that can't be right. I think your journey will hold many surprises, and I hope it holds many joys. I'll take you back to town, Lily. You're doing everything you can for your partner, even though you're not a trainer. I like that kind of person, so I can't help but give you a hand. Dang, much respect. <laughs> Oi, you're Kahuna Olivia. I'm Hal from Iki Town. You've got to let me battle you. Oh, hey, New Age. <laughs> Guess what? This weird green guy from Aether told me to come to Hano Grand Resort once I finished up with my grand trial here on Akala. Crazy, right? Told me that too. Oh, the Aether Foundation. I'm not sure what he wants with you, New Age, but why not go find out? If you don't want to keep him waiting, then Charizard should get you there in no time. The Hano Grand Resort lies just over the bridge near the Dimensional Research Lab. Okay. Uh, um, I think I'll stay here. I'd like to see how Hao's battle goes, too. Even though I hate to see Pokemon get hurt. But I know that both of you and your Pokemon are dedicated to battling beside you, too. I may not be as strong as my Gramps Hala, but I can still raise up Torcat and the rest of my team to do their best. You've only had like two Pokemon this whole time. Oh, you're just Hal, right? And what's wrong with that? Who cares if you're Hala's grandson? Now show me what Hal can do. Oh, snap. Alright, well. Let's get up out of here, Charizard. Alright, let's check it out. Dang. This is a pretty, uh, schnazzy hotel. Oh, yo! It's a Wingo! I got one of those! Oh my gosh, it's adorable. That Pelber, do you think it's wild or does it belong to someone at the hotel? I don't know, yo. What's down here? Okay, a boat. Clean. Can I, like, surf? I feel like I can. No? Dang. That would have been cool. Okay. So there's a beach over there we can explore. Lola is so interesting because it has all these different archi architectural styles. Oh. Way to go. I said it. Ugh. Architectural. Fancy. What's up, Pikachu? Pika Shushu. <laughs> Master Chester, this is your first vacation in three years. Please forget that you're a famous star and just enjoy being a regular Pikachu for once. Oh my gosh. Pikachu's living the high life. Alright, that leads to the beach. Let's just go up into this hotel for now. Dang, this hotel is huge. Can't see you. There's a pillar in the way. So, what's up? So you've come at last. Ah, but forgive me, I've yet to introduce myself. You got some crazy glasses. Call me Faba. I told you before that I would show you something astounding, right? Well, that wondrous place is Aether Paradise. Okay. Let me tell you about Aether Paradise. Just as the name suggests, Aether Paradise is a veritable paradise for Pokemon that floats as far out in the sea as surrounding Alola. It's an arti artifactal, artifactual... Artifactio? <laughs> All these words. Nice that Pokemon, dude. Made entirely by human technology for the protecting of Pokemon. Of course, I'm an adult who keeps his promises, so I'll prove to you that I have... That all I've told you is the absolute truth with a tour of the Aether Paradise. Um, alright, let's check it out. Good then. You'll come with me to the Aether Paradise? Oh, the Aether Paradise will amaze you. Wait, take me too. Yo, he didn't make all these promises. Oh? Even Kahuna Olivia has come to see you off. As a Kahuna, I look after all the trial goers who come to my island. They're like my own children. Not that I've got any. I've never even gotten married. Oh, snap. <laughs> Listen up, you two. Your greatest opponent is always yourself. Your greatest ally is the Pokemon beside you. Dang. You coming too, Professor? <laughs> I've got my own business to attend to. 
You go see all the amazing tech that Aether's developing and tell me all about it later. Yeah. That's right. I'll see you on the next island. Ula Ula Island. Yeah. Then let's meet up at Mally Garden. Alright, sounds good. I guess we can come back anytime we want to, huh? True, true. Then let us enjoy an adventure upon that grand vessel and take us across the high seas. By which I mean to say, the ferry. Okay. I, I don't know what's going on. I'm just kind of joining y'all.